Welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you the global version the original, brand new top selling hybrid inverter product on AliExpress, with discount price. Introductory article on electronic shifting. It's not a new concept, with everyone from Shimano, DI2, to Archer and others coming up with their own version, some of these require replacing the existing derailleur, while others should allow for non-destructive modification. What Jesse did not find among this constellation of options was a version that would work with existing derailleurs, did not require destructive modifications, and have a long battery. Life.Jesse's design omits the servo present in Archer's design and uses the existing derailleur spring with the reasoning explained in a nice spring physics refresher. Instead a stepper is used along with a matched balancer spring, that in testing, managed over three months of standby time, with a 3,700 Mali ion battery and thousands of shifts. At the core of the system is an Arduino Pro mini board, the code for which is available along with the design. Plans.The project is not done at this point, of course, with a whole range of improvements still to be added, including a case, so that the shifter can be used outside in the rain. For the overwhelming majority of bicycles out there that feature multiple gears, switching between these is done purely mechanically, with a cable. Generally this uses a derailleur, which forms part of the gear switching and chain tensioning mechanism. As a mechanical system, it's reliable when well maintained, but tuning it can be a real hassle. This is where an electronic shifter should be able to provide faster, more reliable and quieter shifting, and is also where Jesse Duald S electronic shifting project begins. Several documents regarding electrical testing are available to be viewed on the FCC website under the application name. PRJ 330 Ergo Power Controls Plus Calipers. The new pictures clearly show a new Campagnolo shifter, likely to be a super record model, devoid of any thumb shifter button. There look to be two smaller paddle style shift buttons alongside the brake lever itself. The shifters look like they will use CR2023 coin cell batteries, which will mimic the wireless offerings from Shimano and SRAM. The new pictures clearly show a new Campagnolo shifter, likely to be a super record model, devoid of any thumb shifter button. There look to be two smaller paddle style shift buttons alongside the brake lever itself. The shifters look like they will use CR2023 coin cell batteries, which will mimic the wireless offerings from Shimano and SRAM. The pictured shifters also don't look as tall as current super record models, with a design that almost looks more in line with Campagnolo shifters of yesteryear. Campagnolo also filed a patent recently, US 2023-00316668A1, showing plans for a shifter design using a coin cell battery, which would at least show they are looking to develop wireless electronic shift levers. SRAM and Shimano already have wireless and semi-wireless Graubsit offerings, and with more and more system integration featuring on road bikes, life gets a lot easier especially in the cockpit area, when you have wireless shifters. A range of cabling issues are eliminated, and it also opens the door to other design concepts. Simply pairing wireless shifters to derailleurs makes life a lot easier these days when building a high-end road bike with integrated cable routing. It's likely Campagnolo has been planning this development for a while, in no small part to help ensure their equipment fits in with manufacturers' handlebar and cockpit designs. It also appears some new super record Graubsit components, have been listed online on the Northwest Bicycle website, showing some new wireless Graubsit components. Several components are listed as Campagnolo Super Record WRL, which we assume means wireless. There appear to be some revised gearing options from Campagnolo, with a 10-tooth cassette sprocket, and some lower chainset gearing options, including 2945T3248T3450T. This seems to be closer to SRAM's X-Range gearing system, though its likely larger chainrings will be manufactured for professional riders using the equipment. There also looks to be a new Campagnolo disc rotor on the way, with a new generation Campagnolo Super Record WRL center lock disc listed in 140 and 160 mm diameters. Nothing is certain at this stage, but perhaps these new ratios could signal the dawn of something of a new era for Campagnolo, with a focus on more adventure endurance gravel capable gearing. Disclaimers, these choices may be out of date, all of these products may not be in stores. We don't know when this will be back in stock. You need to go top Hybrid Inverter 2023 review link to see the most recent updates to the list. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to this channel.